want to wish uh, sweetie uh, you happy anniversary and let you know that a year from now we will not be celebrating it in front of 40 million people okay, i'm sure this was the mo most romantic place you could imagine <laughs> here here with me so i <laughs> the president has a view very similar to the view he had when he ran four years ago that a bigger government spending more taxing more regulating more if you will trickle down government would work that's not the right answer for america governor romney uh, has a perspective that says uh, if we cut taxes skew towards the wealthy and roll back regulations that uh, we'll be better off i've got a different view we're way over our first 15 minutes it's fun isn't it it's okay it's great donald trump is a small business and i know donald trump doesn't like to think of himself as small anything it's not just donald trump you're taxing it's all those businesses that employ one quarter of the workers in America, these small businesses that are taxed as individuals. You raise taxes and you kill jobs. Now, does anybody think that ExxonMobil needs some extra money? Did you said you get a deduction for taking a plant overseas? Look, I've been in business for 25 years. I have no idea what you're talking about. I maybe need to get a new accountant. Why wouldn't we eliminate uh, tax breaks for corporate jets? My attitude is if you got a corporate jet, you can probably afford to pay full freight, not get a special break for it. I'm sorry, Jim. I I'm going to stop the subsidy to PBS. I'm going to stop other things. I like PBS. I love Big Bird. I actually like you, too. You've been president four years. You said you cut the deficit in half. It's now four years later. We still have trillion dollar deficits. The CBO says we'll have a trillion dollar deficit each of the next four years. If you're reelected, we'll get to a tri trillion dollar debt.